Yeah, but this is a really interesting concept. So year eight of the River City Science Academy STEM and Health Expo kicks off this Saturday. So I dropped by one of their four locations to see some of their latest scientific creations. The STEM and Health Expo is this huge event that we have at River City Science Academy. Uh, we have science experiments and shows that our students put on, and we also have STEM and health organizations from all over Jacksonville come on out and set up vendor tables. We have um, a DJ that provides a lot of fun music and dancing, fun zone with bounce houses, food trucks, the whole shebang. That's Alex Dreyer talking about River City Science Academy's upcoming eighth annual STEM and Health Expo. She shares what the RCSA experience is about. We are a public charter school here in Jacksonville. We have four locations, and across those four locations, we serve grades K through 12. Um, we have STEM-focused curriculum, which just means that a lot of our students are able to engage in more STEM activities, um, STEM extracurriculars. From kindergarten, they start going to STEM class and kind of interacting with those kind of subjects a little bit more. She explains why they start working with students at such a young age. So at River City Science Academy, we really want our students to start an interest in STEM really early, and that way they're going to stay into that field and go into it after they graduate high school and hopefully stay in Jacksonville and bring some fun STEM careers here in Jacksonville. Well, let's hear from a couple of those students. When I was little, I actually wanted to be a scientist. Um, that group kind of changed, but I still didn't change schools because of how well-rounded our CSA was. It's very great. Yeah, for me, it was just like being able to go in at second grade, and I'm still there in 10th grade today, you know? Very cool. I mean, like you start off with just little math games and then you move on just you're experiment with, experimenting with like dry ice now. So it's like it's a pretty big evolution. Yeah. Alex has more of what attendees can expect at this weekend's expo. We're going to have a lot of exciting things that our guests will be able to interact with. We have superheroes coming in their superhero costumes, um, clowns, and we even have JEA. They're bringing a utility truck. We're going to have JSO's dive team, which is really fun to explore. Um, so just lots of different things to engage in and interact with. Uh, we have a lot of health vendors coming in that will have different things set up. A little uh, chiropractor might have a massage table set up, um, some free health screenings that will be available as well. The RCSA fam shares why everyone from the grandkids to the grandparents should roll out to the STEM and Health Expo. Even if you're not a fan of math and science, it's still very entertaining to see. And everyone from different grade levels and ages actually come. Even like people's parents come and still enjoy it. It's very great to like see um, all these different um, experiments going on. Like for example, one time we had elephant toothpaste oh, yeah. happening and everybody like gathered in the court and it just went up like five feet and it was so cool to see and it's just really nice like um, they explained it, they explained it very well so even if you're having like trouble like to get ideas and concepts it's still very like um, light. Definitely that science is fun, uh, math is fun, engineering, technology, um, you know we our students really put on some spectacular uh, shows, we have main events that uh, show some great experiments and just also how those can be applied in real world, real world uh, situations. And I'm Rance Adams for River City Live. So uh, I feel dumb, but <laughs> those kids are so smart and so cool. So kudos to them and good luck with them. So the River City Science uh, Academy uh, STEM and Health Expo is this Saturday from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. at their Beach Boulevard location. It is free, but you will need cash for like some of the vendors, some of the food and all that stuff. And they also offer shuttle services from a car when you park across the street. You can find out more information at flstem.com. Did you have a favorite experiment when you were there? They were all cool. I, I really couldn't pick one because then it would just probably make somebody feel sad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true, that's true. Did they let you play around with it or no? No, they were smart. Yeah. They did not want me to destroy the school. <laughs> I wouldn't be able to walk away from that sand thing. Oh, I, I would just be there all day. We should oh, build one in our office. Why couldn't we? I think we should. Ooh, inspired. Ideas. <laughs> we'll, we'll noodle that and we'll be right back with more River City Live.